It really is you. <laughs> you returned to us at last. Yes. Uh, let's celebrate. You reclaim the throne. We'll rebuild. Me and you against the world. Huh? Just like the old days. I'm... not staying. I don't understand. You're here. Maybe together we can take back what's ours. I only just got back what's mine. I still have work to do. You've seen what's left of the realm, right? Do we really mean that little to you? You question my loyalty? Vanaheim turned its back on me. Oh, you still can't let go of that old fight. It was my duty to save as many of our people as possible. My responsibility. One you didn't take seriously then, and from the looks of it, one you don't now. You think this is a game to me? Yeah. <sighs> we lost everything to that maniac you called husband. The man's family set me on fire. How did you expect me to react? Like my brother. Like the boy that used to have my back no matter what. And who I always supported no matter how selfish his choices. <sighs> I expected you to come and find me. That no matter how hurt or angry, you wouldn't abandon me. Freya, please. I thought you were dead. No. I've had to live lifetimes with those last awful words I said to you. Have any idea what that's like? Knowing that your own selfishness hurt the person that you cared about the most. Abandon you. Oh, Freya. I mourned you. Oh, I've missed you so much. And I, you, Ingrid. But I won't bind myself to another realm when I finally have my freedom. I'll send help, though. And I will come back. I promise. This hasn't been your home for a long time, has it? What you gotta do. All right, all right, that's enough. Ain't y'all got nothing better to do than gawking at family sorting squabbles? Come on, you two. Not you. Got a few things to square with y'all. First is you collecting your spare heads. Second is that sigil magic I smell on your boat. Reckon that's an idea I'll steal. How's about I set you up with some sonic mojo? Call it a trade. Very well. Third of all, if and you ain't staying here. Bears mentioning its injury and I find ourselves running a flop house for unemployed gods. If you're done freezing your backside off in Midgard, maybe come back with Beardo there. Check up on your old pal Tyr. That's kind of you, Brock. I may do just that. Well, all right then. I'll meet y'all back at the house. 
Unless you want me to fix anything up first. Well, brother, care to meet our new allies? Or shall we depart? I suppose that big fella we're traveling with might want to help me with a thing? Mayhaps. Now and again, he's in the mood to make me cool. I was broken when he found me. The truth I'd pledged my life to, it was a lie. Lord Freyr put what was left of me back together. Gave me something real to believe in. That's Freyr, the Lord of Second Chances. He saved me. Gave me a family, a purpose. And I will gladly die for both. Thank you. He's lucky to have you. Tell me about the camp dog. Lord Freyr found her half dead in the jungle. She probably escaped the Blothunder breeding farm north of here. We all told him she was beyond saving. But he never gave up. She healed and hasn't left us since. She's a sweet girl. <laughs> She's pure of heart. Believes in your goodness, even if you don't. Hey. I'm glad it worked. Uh, whatever you hope to do out there. I'm still not sure I totally get you, or what your deal is, but... As long as you have her back... I'll have yours. Should we ask him? Don't be rude. What's rude about asking for help? Big Veer, my love. Focus on your work. You need to weave those tighter. Oh, excuse me. Can you stop and help a lady out, please? I remember where to look for a gateway. Follow me. Well, you two seem to be getting on since completing your mission. Dare I hope this alliance has some staying power after all? It seems to me we share a common enemy. Kratos, you may not accept that Ragnarok is inevitable, but you're smart enough to know Odin is a threat. Whatever comes next, our best chance of surviving it is to work together. Do you agree? I do. Then as to Brock's offer, you can imagine staying under the same roof as a couple former enemies? No further temptations towards terrible vengeance? Not against you. Either of you. You have my word.
This lock is different from others you might know. You'll need an enchantment on your chisel to use it. Bruna. Go ahead, carve the letter. Sula. It's an incantation. I'll speak it. Su na. Elves and flares can't mention the gate like this in Alpine. Get drawn about some sacred light elf sanctum out past the barrens. A trip to Alfheim. Well, we can decide at the gateway. This boat should get us there if we can clear those vines. Remember what to do? There's a fallen log in the river. It has something on it I don't recognize. So it's true. Tears really alive? Aye. Not exactly ship shape. He sleeps in a broom closet now. But he's adjusting. How did you find him? Largely, that's down to Atreus having figured out how to access the prophecies giants reserved for their own kind. We only learned of it ourselves after Thor and Odin came calling. To your home? Is it still standing? Barely. But all the violence was seemingly just a distraction to let Odin have a private word with Atreus. Odin was alone with your son? Did he tell you what they spoke of? Yes. He said that Odin invited him to Asgard to help him find his answers. The answers he's rushing into fate in search of. That's troubling. Well, if you're ready to talk to him, the Mystic Gateway is ahead. If not, I have some unfinished business up this river I could use your help with. Or we can follow up on that elven sanctum out in Alfheim's desert. Hmm. If you want to continue exploring, we'll need to remove that log in the river. What is this? The crest of Skirnir. Never quite as smart as he thought. <laughs> <laughs>